Hi there, I'm Michael with eTrailer.com. Today we're gonna to take a quick look at this D-Max stainless steel disc brake kit. Uh, these disc brakes do have an 11 inch diameter uh, rotor. It's got the slip-on design, so it will fit right over your standard idler hubs. It'll be held in place with your existing wheel bolts. So these are really gonna be a great way to upgrade your trailer. If you've got an idler axle, you wanna add some brakes so that uh, your trailer can slow and stop itself instead of relying on your tow vehicle's brakes to slow and stop both. So adding brakes like this is gonna to help to decrease the strain on your tow vehicle's braking system. Or if you already have disc brakes and you're just looking to upgrade to a higher quality, these are stainless steel. So the uh, rotor, the calipers, the caliper mounting brackets, it's all stainless steel. So it is gonna hold up really well for you, especially for uh, boat trailers that are uh, in coastal areas where that salt, uh, water in the air can help uh, cause a lot of uh, corrosion. Uh, There's also gonna hold up really well if you're in uh, snowy areas where your roads are heavily treated. Really any of those corrosive environments that can uh, wreak havoc on a lot of your other materials, these are gonna hold up really well for you. And D-Max as a brand, they are very focused on quality. So in my mind, these are kind of the most premium option there is. If you are looking for uh, something that's gonna hold up really well, perform really well, uh, this is gonna be a great way to go. Uh, these do have the vented design, so it's gonna help dissipate your heat faster to prevent premature brake pad wear. But then they also have the uh, drainage holes here in the hat section. Uh, that's also going to help dissipate heat, but then it's also going to uh, make sure that any water that's uh, caught in there after you pull your boat out of the water or uh, as humidity uh, condenses, it's going to allow that water to drain out so it's not sitting in there causing corrosion. These are going to work for your uh, 3,500 pound capacity axles. You can see we've got the five on four and a half inch bolt pattern here with our half inch diameter uh, wheel bolt holes there. So these will work for your wheels that are 14 inches and larger. On the back side, we do have our four bolt brake flange configuration. So very simple to get mounted on your axle. Uh, just put these in place. Now I will say um, one caveat, if you are upgrading from an idler axle to having brakes on your trailer, uh, it is gonna be uh, quite a project for you. You'll have to make sure that you've got a hydraulic brake actuator and brake lines running back. Uh, you wanna make sure that they're rated for 1500 PSI or higher in order to provide uh, the pressure needed to properly activate your disc brakes. Uh, so getting that all installed, it's, it's gonna be quite a bit. Uh, we do have all the components that you need here at eTrailer.com, uh, but I, I do think it is gonna be well worth your while. If you are looking to add disc brakes, uh, they are gonna be a great option for you as far as your stopping capabilities. They're gonna perform really well. Uh, these do have ceramic brake pads, uh, so they are going to give you an increased stopping power, uh, less dust, uh, less squeaking uh, over your other uh, semi-metallic and um, NAO options that are out there. Uh, these are gonna hold up really well, do a really good job, give you great performance. We also have a stainless steel two and a quarter inch piston that provides nice, fast, responsive braking for you. So as far as performance goes, uh, these are gonna be a great uh, option. They're also going to have that stainless steel construction. So they are gonna hold up really well, last you a nice long time. So if you are looking for the premium, uh, disc brake set for your trailer to convert it from that idler axle uh, to a braking axle, this is gonna be the way to go. That completes our look for today. Again, I'm Michael with eTrailer.com. Thanks for watching.